Coronavirus is even having an impact on food banks. They are short on donations, money, and volunteers. Kara Seven's Ryan Sims shows you the situation behind the shortage. Food banks are really having to switch things up. Let me show you. Obviously, if I was a shopper normally, I'd be able to take one of these food items, just take it off the shelves. Now, though, shoppers cannot do that. Instead, volunteers having to wear gloves and are handing items directly to customers. Uh, sometimes the people don't understand that, you, that you're the one that's got to touch the food nowadays, uh, you know, because of the virus. You want to have them have these are daunting, drastic times for the volunteers of America Food Bank in Everett. We get one thing up here. And a long line of shoppers helping so many people isn't easy, especially now. We've had certain things like I think, you know, flu outbreaks, you know, that have been a little bit higher than normal, uh, but nothing to this extent. At this food bank alone, money from some donors has plunged 50 percent. And for the food that does come in, well, there are far fewer people to stock these shelves. It's this balance and dynamic. I mean, social distancing is, is a thing, and so big groups of volunteers that we have counted on um, are not able to come into the food bank right now. When it gets down to the nitty gritty, um, yeah, we all just have to pitch in, and it, you know, it takes a little bit longer to get things done. So you'll get two more. In normal times, a typical Wednesday would see around 20 volunteers here. Today, it was half that. You got a card? Um, yeah. Okay. Meaning those who did show up, like Tahi Shepard, were on overdrive. I grew up in these streets, ran amok, whatever, you know, so a lot of these people, they're here too, so we're all human beings at the end of the day, you know, we all got to eat. This food bank is now beefing up partnerships with grocery stores across western Washington. Valuable support, no doubt, as supplies run low. And this food bank was just one of many who told us that uh, they are struggling with not only donations, but volunteers. If you want to help out, again, those supplies are running low. Uh, we do have a link on our website, Cairo7.com. We're live in Everett tonight. Ryan Sims, Cairo 7 News.